You are a sad man, Arthur Morgan. But I know you love me. Desperately. You're my favorite parasite. No. Ringworm's my favorite parasite. You're my second favorite parasite. Very funny. I lied. Ringworm. Then rats with the plague. Then you. Shut up. <laughs> oh. your mouth, mister. So, that was a quiet drink? first one was pretty quiet. <laughs> yeah, the first one was pretty quiet. At least it took your mind off goddamn Mikey. Well, that's certainly true. I gotta get out of here. I'm just gonna have a little sit down and feel sorry for myself. <sighs> you know a lot about you. Do you? You're a wanted man, Mr. Morgan. $5,000 for your head alone. $5,000? For me? Can I turn myself in? Where's that letter? Oh, are you reading his mail now? Oh, robbing and killing's okay, but letter reading's where we draw the line. Mm -hmm. Here. <clears throat> Dear Aunt Kathy. You are something else. I haven't heard from you in some time. So I pray to the Lord above that your health has not deteriorated further. Blah, blah, blah. It's boring. Just okay. Here we are. So, what's the plan? I shoot the shopkeeper while you... No! You insane? I thought we was outlaws. Outlaws. Not idiots. We rob fools that rob other people. These people, they're just trying to get by. So you head on in there and you buy some food to eat. And no guns. You're sure? This time, there'll be time for killing soon enough. Well, that could have gone smoother. That'll be on my gravestone. You know what, Dutch? Next time, let's not damn discretion. Seemed like a good lead. I know, but... Well, we made it. 
Thanks to you. Don't mention it. Yeah, you're a good kid. Yeah, and we each got $15. Oh, and a quarter. Don't forget the quarter. Shut up, Arthur. What is it? It's not good news. Well, I guess that. You got tuberculosis. I'm really sorry for you, son. It's a hell of a thing. What do you mean? You're real sick. You... It's a progressive disease. And you'll be... Well, the best thing is rest. and Getting somewhere warm and dry and taking it easy. Now, is that possible? Sure, I can just take my winters in my country club in California. No, it's not possible. Well... Jameson! Is Jameson in? He's in South Denise. They got Milliken. Got him and gonna kill him. Unless you bring me John Marston. Right now. You got one minute. I'm counting. One, two, three. Milliken, is it? Yes, sir. Will you count for me? I got talking to do. Uh, yes, sir. Of course, sir. <clears throat> From one or four, Oh, sir? very funny. No, we must be at 11 by now. 11, 12, 13, faster. 14, 15, 16, up! Well, this poor fool's gonna get his brain shot out. And over what? For nothing. Uh, Milliken, don't stop counting. I can't hear you. Hurry up and bring that asshole out here, you bastards. Come on. <laughs> don't cry, buddy. I don't want to die. Yeah, I know, I know. Hey, hey, John. Hello, you too. Now, no funny business. Well, Mr. Milliken here will stop crying once and for all. Are you ready? Sure. Second time lucky, eh? Second time? <laughs> More like 7,000th. This is my life's work. It is incredible. What? some money. You take it and get out of here and start a new life somewhere. I hear Tahiti's nice. Thank you. Just hop on a train to San Denis, jump on a boat, but avoid Guam. Where? Forget about it. I had a lot of time to think in that jail and I feel like I just don't know Dutch no more. You ain't the only one. And this plan to get us out, it just feels, I don't know. Like he's stringing us along, I know. All right. Cleet, Sadie, you board halfway along. John, you and Arthur are gonna board at the back. Rest of you, follow Mike and I, and join once they stop the train. Here she comes. Should I just sneak on now? John Marston, the terror of the turds. So old David Geddes told you I'm the kind of man to loan a man with two names money so he can buy a rundown farm on account of his lack of farming skills, huh? 
Don't sound too promising when you put it like that. <laughs> well, how would you put it? You've had some bad luck with bounties being stole off of you. And you're about to have some bad luck with getting punched in the face. 